Hello everyone, this is Serious Trivia. Welcome back to another episode of our Legendary Rancho campaign. This is episode 20. We pick it up from turn 81 in the harvest season of 206. So just hopping back into things, uh, Liu Bei betrayed us last episode and we have to basically fight a war throughout the central plains. We're sending armies, you know, from all corners of our map to take care of Liu Bei. Hopefully once we have him wrapped, we can do kind of a joint assault of the north, uh, go through our brother and get the last emperor seek, we already have the second one. Uh, so speaking of the second one, let's start out over here. Uh, this force here is responsible to defend this entire zone. Uh, currently we have this army out here. There's another army here, but I can't do much about that. Uh, I can try to ambush this army, I guess. I mean, they, they can't get through this river except for through this bridge. I don't know what they're going to do. They could easily just sail down. So I think the best option is actually for us to just hover just around here, it. wait for the heal, and stay hidden to encourage them to do some sort of silly stuff, you know, like charge at us. Sun Tzu is going to be busy coming over here. He got to sweep across this way. This army kind of got beaten up. So we got to make our way here. We need some time to heal up so we can't really rush it. They need to pull back because Liu Bei has a force around here that's really scary. And what we need to do is actually bulk this army up quite a bit. So we want this unit here. Hmm. We probably want them to take the mercenary unit away from this group to free that up. And then over here we can swap him for... another range unit like the crossbowmen. And then we free up this slot. Hold on. We're gonna swap this out for a regular archer. And then we're gonna swap this for this. Swap this for this. No, wrong, wrong selection. Okay, they don't have enough replenishment rate right now. Hmm. That's fine. They can just rest up here for a little bit. Just get all the other units ready, and then we'll assault that again. Um, over here, we can actually fight. So we can take back our temple and wipe out Gongsun Zan. Hopefully we get his weapon. So I don't think this is going to be a defeat for us. Uh, they do have a lot of annoying cavalry, but we have Joltai to take care of that. And we have our siege weapon that's relatively healthy. So let's jump into this fight here. Alrighty, we're loaded up in here, beautiful weather, uh, big mountain right behind us, temple right behind us, even though we're attacking the temple, somehow the temple is behind us. But that's perfectly fine, I like to use this hill. So we can put this here, nice overlook, and then he can put it even farther back because he can actually fire over the trees. Alright, what do we want to do with these units? So, I do like fire attack, do fire arrows where we can. And these heavy crossbowmen slightly in the front, regular crossbowmen slightly behind. Random archer unit doing what it can. And we'll spread out the defenses around. So these will protect the front of the thing. I might not even protect the front here. Might do something like a slant protection here. I mean, I guess they can be here. These can hide off to the side. I'm not even going to be concerned about their cavalry because I'm going to be pretty sure that Joltai is going to go charge in first. So we'll take care of that. This guy can defend this flank a little bit. And the girls can be back here. They can heal each other. I think she's above 50% so she can start healing each other. Um, I don't know where the cavalry is going, but this is where we're exposed. Do a fire here. Pop it. Let's go. We will not be doing Gong Sun Zat because he has a gold weapon and we already got a taste of what happens when we duel with gold weapons. But we could, 
Ooh, not those T militias. Yeah, I'm here for the cavalry. Alright, I want to lead the cavalry out. Ooh, especially these. So they don't see our siege weapons. It's too far away for them to see. Even though they're on a hill. Oh, the tree's kind of blocking them. So that's fair. Ooh, they lit themselves on fire? Nice. One of their unit must have the, the, the fire trait where they light stuff on when they're idle. Maybe like a peasant unit. But regardless, they're on fire. Alright, we'll charge out of here. Who routed? The fire got them. Alright, we'll go chase them down. Just to lose them a little bit. Yeah, you can't hit me. I mean, technically I can solo this army, but I kind of want them to go fight us. The troops need experience too. Oh, it's a night battle. They're not in great shape. I do want to kill off the horse archers though. They are super annoying. Alright, they don't have a lot of health, so they're not dueling us. Alright, we want to keep charging. You don't want to get bogged down. Charge at horse archers whenever you can. There's another one right there. Now, how can... How can I lead them over to our siege weapons? At least just over here so they can see our range. Here. I'll let them try to chase me. Come please follow us. Follow us. Yes. Yes. Keep following. I'm still here. I'm still here. Yep. Come out. Let them have it. Uh, I don't know why we're wasting shots on the cavalry. Should shoot this area. Alright, I'm going to try to take Gongsun Zan out here on the open field. See, that's the group we don't want to charge us. I want to slow down this group. And I don't want them to run into our guys. Okay, so we go after their range units in for a surprise. Cataphracts we have to slow down. We can take care of the range. Alright. This is a big fight here. If we can... Ooh, the arrow's coming. If we can get Gongsun Zan right here. There we go. We're getting him. Alright, focus on who you need to be firing at, please. We got him. Alright, now we can pull the cavalry out. Zhou Tai can right, jump back right in to buy us some time. Alright, hit stuff like Jama Jian. There we go. The wife is angry. The son is angry. But they're not powerful, so they can be angry all they want. Oh, they made it to the front line. Okay, there goes one of our units. Um, that one's the militia. I don't actually want them to be here. Here, charge right there. Charge that. Decline. Refuse. Just don't want them to burn. They can stand like close to here. See if they can get the sun. Right, we're kind of protecting this area. Alright, actually we don't need to mind the sun, we gotta go back to the flank. We can use our elite tiger, rapid tiger and warrior of the left to do some damage. Jotai will lead the cavalry into... Alright, follow that actually, don't let them bounce back. Alright, can we get that? Alright, then pull into that. Alright, chase down. Alright, they got him. Collapse. Here, do that. Alright, 
Most of their range is gone. We'll come take care of generals. We'll split the cav. A couple of them to go over here. Alright, they're all routed. So much for our elite unit. Alright, they all routed. That's fine. They're in a garrison. We don't need to really chase. Alright, all I really care about is Dreadbringer. So you can get that. Nope. Ah, I just can't get any gold weapons. Alright, we got the temple back, which helps our satisfaction. And I think we want to throw this army maybe... Hmm... Maybe south. Maybe you want to go this way. Cut this area off. Anyway, Lu Bu is about to join the fight. We'll get to this part and then we'll recruit the Imperial units. We were kind of saving that. Oh, that's where the army's gone. Perfect. You get the three brothers versus Lu Bu here. Liu Guan Zhang, San Ying Zhan Lu Bu. Right? The three brothers versus Lu Bu at Hulao Gate. Didn't really happen historically, but. We can make it happen here in our story. Yeah, with the extra replenishment granted by her, she has a background that gives the army 15% replenishment. Imperial army units are really great in this force. Alright, we'll be able to take care of that. We did that. They're fine. Our southern army, one is taking care of Wang Long right now. Right to the edge. And then we'll sweep across. Oh, we found him again. His army is really weak. We don't have to worry too much about it. We have a level up. Uh, just a court official. All right, and we'll just work down, get his uh, assignment abilities. Seems like he's a bandit too. All right, Zhou Yu's southern army is going north. Uh, we did pick up a spear at the end. She can use that. And we want to take the fishing port, so we want to just hop into the river here. Oh! Surprised by that, actually. I will stand right here then. I don't want to like get caught in the river, not be able to land, or be able to land and then get sandwiched between these two forces. I want to see what he does. This is a relatively fresh army. Yeah, we'll be a little bit patient here. So everyone moved, and uh, we have some cash left over. We don't have much to do here. There's no more trade. All pretenses are gone. We're at war with everyone. Alright, we don't need any turncoats. Let's see. Hmm. Waiting for reforms on that. I think we can go both ways here, but... It's not urgent. This is urgent. After this finishes, we can downgrade. Right, let's repair it. Uh, this is not urgent either. But we don't have any more money. We can only build small stuff now. I'm waiting to build this, but there's no cash. I mean, I guess while we wait, we can upgrade this. And then we'll just demolish, and then this will go away. Because it's the last spot. It's actually not a bad idea. Where is our other super tall commandery? Uh, but it's not the last spot. Yeah, so we have an empty spot for downgrade. Four more turns. Alright, we just gotta save money. We just gotta get into more fights. Uh, that's pretty much all we have to do. Alright, let's... Build something and then continue. There we go. Okay, and then we have all the assignments in place. Yeah, everything's pretty good. I just gotta get this fight going. Alright, let's continue. Alright, so another vassal, Zhu Fu, joined the war. So this is in the south. Um, it's always gonna be a concern, but I think it's okay because we can send an army there after we sweep across Wang Long's forces. We can send an army over here and basically take his land too. So that's good. Okay, we have the Zhang Fang from... Uh, this is Zhang Yan's son, and then a random Zhang Fang. And then Yang Ren with armor here, silver armor. 
His background's not that great. It's like 5% chance of ambushing. And then the same as his dad, 25% post-battle loot income. Um, ignore forest penalties. I mean, I wouldn't say he's bad, but like, I wouldn't go out of my way to spend legitimacy on him right now. Okay, not really relevant. Let's go for the easy stuff first, and then we'll end with this fight. This is probably the highlight of this episode. The three brothers versus Liu Bu. Alright, they are guarding Lu Jiang. We can take them, no worries. But first, let's take... He's just gonna run, isn't he? Go for it, keep running. I don't need to fight him. Alright, we'll take the low casualty. Yeah, we're gonna need these counties for our win condition. He's probably gonna just run to his next county over here, and we're just gonna follow him over there. I doubt he can counterattack any of our cities. Maybe some of the rice patties? Yeah, level 2 is a little low, but... Hmm... We can also just force him into a peace deal as well. I don't think he's a... He's not a vassal. Oh, he is a vassal, isn't he? Right, he's part of the... Alliance? Right, he's a vassal. We have to peace out with Dong Min to peace out with him. I don't know. It's just this untr untrustworthy is making things difficult. Or else... I think we can get a peace with him. But anyhow, we got a horse from that fight. So we can pick up the horse for one of our administrators. It's an expertise horse. Oh, we have a bunch of horses. Okay, so maybe some of our armies can pick up a horse. Wow. Joe, you really needed items. All right, we'll get the instinct on her. Some extra damage doesn't hurt. I don't know. Let's see. Where else can we move first before we jump into fights? So we got more army filtering down. This army is trying to recruit in the farmland. Sun is on his way. It'll take him two more turns. And even if this army fully replenishes, they're not that strong. I don't need to risk it. Wow, they're just not replenishing at all. We need to go to Runan, basically, if we want to heal. Maybe we will, right? We can take like a southern approach because we do need that replenishment going. Uh, it's four turns to get there. All right, that's not worth it. There's more population here. 1.5, yeah. So maybe we can heal better there. There's some mustering bonuses still. So maybe we just stay put. We'll just hold this choke. And obviously we have to answer that or else we're going to lose this again. Where is the best ambush spot? So I think this is pretty flexible here, depending on where he goes. We can also attack. Alright, they moved. Ah, they fell for it. Oh, they, they're in the river. All right, we, we hold here. I think he will come for the trade port. I'm going to trust that Ma Tong doesn't declare war on us. I don't know why I have faith in him, but we do. All right, attack. All right, so we have night battle. That's going to help. It's a fishing port, so the layout's going to be pretty good for us. It's a level two, so it's very weak. And a lot of militia, so very low morale. Right, you see the 26 right here? Minus 15 from this, and then raining fire rocks, gonna really knock them out. So let's jump in here. Alrighty, so just looking at these doors, I don't think they'll charge out, but I think I'm gonna opt for this side just because it's a little bit emptier on this side. Too many trees on that side. Um, although I, I kind of don't like this. We can hit more of the town on that side. You know what, we can go for a straightforward attack and just burn most of the town. We've been on a burning streak recently. So, and there's a hill here, which is really nice. Like, we can still hit the town from this angle. Especially if they charge out. Which I don't think they will, somehow. Like, 
I just don't think they will charge out given the size of their garrison. Usually when the size is... What is... Oh, that's right. He has a... Hmm. Yeah, it's on him and we want the unit so we can't... We can't get rid of it. I mean, it's going to weaken our range setup, but it's going to be good for our front line. Like, we actually have a pretty good front line here. The cavalry is a little weak on this setup. Do they even have cavalry inside? I don't think we need that guy. Uh, hold these guys in the back. All right, we have our bandit girl with poison volley. She can stay in the front, no dueling. This bandit girl, although she has a unique portrait, she has the same basic build, no skill tree difference whatsoever. So not sure how we're going to use that. And I don't care if we have, they have cavalry or not, which I don't think they do, but they have generals. So this is going to do something. Right, let's see if they come out. I don't think they will. Alright, we're going to micro the tribuchet then. It's a dry day, so it's going to light things up. Ooh. Just like one shot in each stone, and then like the fire will spread. This one is going to be the hard one to kill. Look, one touch, a blaze, autumn dry night. I didn't hit it, it overshot it. Come on, just touch it. All you need to do is touch it. Oh my god. Oh, there we go. Yeah, all they need to do is touch it. Now I want one to overshoot into that zone. Right there. Perfect. Oh, 48%. That's not enough. Needs to be over 50 to spread a fire. There we go. That should do it. Oh, come on. Seriously? Hit a different spot? There we go. Same thing here. No, not missing enough. Miss farther. Perfect. All right. Save a few ammo. So this is going to spread to that whole zone. This is going to spread to that whole zone. So that tower's gone. That tower's gone. This thing's all gone. That tower is the only one left. Just look at the settlement damage. Minus six. It's going to get worse. If I can only shoot over there, um, I can. I think just got to move up a little bit. Yeah, there's not many shots left. We're just going to use them on the town. They're not charging uh, us anyways. Um, they can turn off for a second. Is there anyone willing to duel? Well, they're all willing to duel. They all have no relationship. What's, oh, he has a good weapon. So these two we can beat. This one, I'm not so sure. Alright, let's get a duel started while we wait for that. Um, I'll start one after I fire Poison Volley. No one said it had to be fair. Alright, pull back a little bit. We'll start with him. Alright, stop firing. One shot should be good enough. Yeah, that fire is good enough. Hit this part too. There's nothing we can buff her with, so she's on her own. A pair of silver axes versus like a basic weapon. Plus we poisoned him before. Oh, actually we didn't. Oh, we didn't poison him before. I uh, still should win. No worries. You see how the massive routing is happening? We, we didn't do much. The poison volley and mostly settlement damage. Settlement damage minus 10 morale now. Yeah, so you don't have to kill the people. You can just kill the town. If, wait, what are they doing? They're twisting and turning the range. Alright, we're winning. We'll go back for the execution, hopefully. We'll get back in time. Fire is burning here. Can we burn that, please? Alright, here the fire go. Perfect timing. Both arms off. 
All right, we'll go poison volley one more time, and then we'll challenge her. Did we start a fire here? Yes, we did. All right, this little area will burn down too. You see the massive routing going on? All right, we'll aim directly at her. Fire, please. She's a little tougher because she does have ability right here that boosts her melee evasion. Did we hit it? Yeah, we hit it. Stop firing. We burned the whole town down. Except for this part's not catching fire yet, but it will. We can speed it up a little. One last shot. All right, they can pull back now. Yeah, good luck with your morale. Settlement damage minus 12. You can fire it, Will. Come snipe at him. All right, execution time. Come on. There we go. Also, both arms gone. Really? You guys want to charge me? How do they have seven morale? Hold on. We're gonna pull back over here. They can't chase that far out of the settlement. Fire, cover me. Cover fire, cover fire. We actually have low morale. There we go. Cover us. I want to get back to the horse. Why are we low morale? Sustained damage? Uh, we I guess we're injured a little bit. Get back on our horse. Poison volley this last group of G militias over here. And that's it. He's the only man standing. And everyone else has routed because the town's pieced out already. Alright, we just need to get on the horse. Actually, you know what? We're planning to fire this right now. Are we firing? Yes, we are. Not doing much damage, though. Alright, get back on the horse. Alright, they routed. We just need to route this guy. Wait, why is she not getting on? Alright, he's finished. Um... Try to hit that. We'll go over here. Try to poison volley him. We could use our cavalry, but then we'll take casualties. I'd rather just not take any casualties in this fight. Oh, that's the captain unit. No wonder why. They're poisoned. He's poisoned. We're getting hit. Alright, charge that. Alright, he should route now. There's no other- oh, there's still one more unit. Yeah, usually when there's no other unit, the general just route. We could just use our range advantage on him. Just to make sure we take no losses here. But usually, let's let's get that to route, and I think he'll just naturally route. Please? Why so stubborn? Why make us waste our ammo on you?
All right, under files for minus two, we switch one of them to fire arrows. So now it's under fire minus four. Take some damage, and then he's gonna change his tune. There we go. Finally. All right, that's a clean siege right there. Oh, not much of a town left, but don't worry. We'll get it without any damage. Alrighty. Clean siege. So we can execute him for the axe, which I kind of want to do. Labor... How? Okay. I mean, I don't see why we can't see all the stuff. We have it all here. This depends on if we want to ultimately get peace with Liu Bei or not. Because we want peace, we probably want to employ, take his axe, and then fire him. And we're going to keep him. Yeah. Like, I can definitely afford the salary. Okay, we got another general on top of that as well. Another laborer, but this one's worse. Oh, he has reach. Oh, he has a bunch of good stuff. Okay, not bad. Um, we want to fire the new guy. This one. Goodbye. Uh, she can switch the axe next turn. We want... Reach? No, we have reach. Yeah, I guess we just go down. Alright, they can actually set sail and cut over here to Yangzhou. And then set sail again, cut here to Guangling. They can take the coastal sweep. Li Bu is going to be busy over here. Alright, so this is what we've been waiting for. How to take down the three brothers. Now, each of them are Othorn, so the minute we kill one, the other two gets enraged, heals, extra damage. And even we're going to have a tough time against that. But we have two gold weapons versus their three. We have a debuff on dueling. You could use some items to be honest here. Alright, boost crossbow. We have two right here. We can swap this with the uh, crossbow unit. Oh, we can't. She's not hot. Wait. Oh, she's a she's a champion. That's right. She can't get regular crossbow units. She can only pick up militia. But she should do this. Hmm. Maybe after this battle. Well, at least they think it's close. Uh, we get some morale bonus, which is nice. Um, I like how they're stuck on the first militia army that they started the game with. This is mostly what they started the game with, except for they recruited some E archers here in addition to what they have. So the army is relatively weak. Yeah, the army is relatively weak. The generals are insanely strong, though. Shuang uh, Jian, Serpent Spear, Green Crescent, Dragon Blade. Hmm. All right, let's see how we do here. All right, it is raining. That's not great. Um, the terrain's really good. Because they have towers here, they actually won't be charging out at us, which is actually awesome. I kind of want to fight. Hmm, where do we have like the highest elevation? Maybe here. Yeah, I think I want to take this hill. So, uh, this is played better straight on, does the most damage that way. This can go actually from the side. Okay. Okay with this. This is a little downhill. Be better if they can... Yeah, probably better if they just do this. Uh, and if they do charge us, we just give up on that. Alright, the infantry line's really not great here. 
That's it. That's like all the protection we can really offer here. Alright, it's okay. Other than those E-Archers, they don't really have much uh, in terms of range anyways. Our cavalry is quite good. They have some Militia Melee Cav, I think. That's about it. I'm not going to use those. Alright, we're going to try to duel. It's going to be tricky. Active buff. Holy... Only 20 seconds. That's strong. Two point two hundred fifty percent damage. Oh, she boosts everyone melee. Okay, all right, all right. They're both boosting. She's also not dueling. We're gonna try to initiate the duel on our terms. All right, Guan Yu is willing. Zhang Fei is willing. I think we want to duel Guan Yu first. I think I want to lure him out, so we get less experience this way, but but this way we can guarantee that he comes out towards us. Challenge us, challenge us. Oh, he's not, they're not willing to come out. Okay, so in this case, we just maximize range. Alright, and then we go with him for our two abilities. Get closer, get closer. Alright, the tower is going to be hitting us. Can we kill the towers? I want to see this duel. But I also don't want those two to just stand still. Oh, we're killing him fast. Wow. Yeah, we're getting hit by the archers. Oh, he's dead. We choked him out. That was fast. Okay. Zhang Fei Liu Bei, very unhappy incoming. Get back on the horse, get back on the horse. Can we kill this? Alright, Zhang Fei, we'll do Zhang Fei as well. Get on the horse first, we'll pull them away. They can't do it right now because they're enraged. They'll snap out of it very soon. We have the red hair, there's no way he catch us. Alright, I want to pull Zhang Fei into a duel, and these two can slap Liu Bei around. Can we stop shooting him? Actually, go charge him. You guys stay with here. I want to see Zhang Fei with the boosted damage versus us. So Zhang Fei has a boost because we killed his O-Thorn. So it's close. He's doing a bunch of damage to us. Oh, it's very close. I don't know who's going to win. Oh, we got it. Barely. Nobody's going to get healed again. Oh, he died at the same time. Oh, we lucked out. We lucked out. He should have got a big heal, but he didn't. Because we killed him like almost the same time. Okay. Great. He was extremely injured, but the rest of this fight is simple. Alright, did we kill it? Okay, let's take this down too. Yobe did some damage. Just some. Um, they have what? What are these? E archers? Alright, 200 range. Not that bad. We'll let the daughter go in. Can we hit these spear units? Hmm. I think if we're careful, we can get them set up nicely here. Alright, just pound the zone. Alright, she caused fear? Scare. Okay, just keep causing scare. We'll slowly shred them. Oh, 
Alright, good. Basically, she, if any range unit get close, she'll charge them. Else, these guys would just shred people. We'll charge that. Give myself a boost. A lot of spear units. We'll charge that. Yeah, the archer should shred everything here. We're just going to chase a few of these range units around. Can move up even closer, move these guys up in case they need reinforcements. Uh, we'll just keep charging different ones. Oh, this one's getting close. Can we shoot this first? Yeah, they're firing back. They're firing back. Why are we not listen? Listen to me. These units are just not listening to me. Come on, it's five on one. We can't overwhelm you. All right, don't chase. Shoot the next one. Where's their flag? Let's go get that flag. Alright, we're charging that. It's gonna lose us a lot of cavalry, but I think it's okay. We'll charge this way a little. This one just feels like kind of open here. I come to here. Hold on, hold on. Do not run to those. Divert. Turn. Swing. I right, go for that now. Fire these. Pull. Uh, they got caught. That's fine. Alright, just gotta force them to run. Alright, they're clearly not braced. Come on. Can we go through them? There we go. Charge that. We can charge through that. Switch targets, switch targets. Route. Route. Oh. I didn't know they were in so much already. Alright, we're good. Get them before they charge our cavalry. Switch to sword, counter charge. We won. Whew. There goes Liu Bei and his brothers. We got a little impatient at the end of the cavalry charge, but that was more fun. Alrighty, so we got them pretty good, and with our replenishment rate, we should be totally fine. 
Oh, we got Zhang Fei. Oh, man, the spear. Hmm. I really want to execute him. Sun Ce could be using this. Think about it. But he has his father's sword. Zhou Tai could be using this. <sighs> I think we do it. They betrayed us. We try to keep them as friends. Alright, so I guess the policy now is no mercy against Liu Bei for the rest of the way. There's no need to commit halfway for something. Um, Rage of Lu Ji. Okay, we'll take that. Flower on the bat battlefield. Melee evasion, extra morale. But I don't want this. I kind of want to just go the long way. All right, flaming shots. Yeah, they heal fast. They're gonna go for this. They're gonna cut through, and then they can take care of this area, freeing up Zhou Tai, who is gonna get a nice weapon boost here. That's the whole reason we're doing it. So they didn't go very far. Oh, actually no. Right, this is same turn. I forgot. We saved that battle for the end. So we have 11k now. So we have plenty of cash to spend. Where do we want to spend it on? Um, hold on. We have those big tall commanderies which we need to downgrade like this. So that's working. Hmm. This should be upgraded. That needs to go up. All right, tier five, finally. All right, these are in no rush. This one's gonna be corruption reduction. I wanna upgrade this, but we're short on cash again. Hmm. Yeah, at this point, you need to hit level 5 before we downgrade as well. And this... Oh, man. A lot of things still need to happen. Just don't have the cash. I think we should get the copper mine going. We're close to getting those reforms. Alright, nothing's changed here. Let's continue here. I think we're good. Alright, we got them in the ambush. Yuan Shao's force landed here at the trade port. We're just going to delegate away. Uh, we'll take more casualties, but we'll heal back pretty easily, so save us some time. Not too much. Let's see. Gong Sha Chen. No items. No items. This is with our brother. I think we just get more money. Alright, Dong Min signed a peace deal with Ma Teng. Ma Teng declared war on Liu Zhang. Okay, Ma Teng's going south, that's good. So as much as I want to pull this army here, because we have a problem here, I can't, because this army is still around, and the imp and we, we have to protect the Emperor seat, so we're going to just track them down, clean them up. Alright. We're going back over here. We might consider running Sun Tzu back. But he's right here. Alright, he went this way. Silly him. 
Cornell's army is back. So we're busy defending around here. Night battle. Ooh. We get reinforcements. Okay, alright, we'll take it. Serpent Spear. Ah, uh, we can't chase them down. That's fine. We'll try to get back on the road. I think we can brute force this as well. Oh no, no one can reach them. Actually, I'm gonna go halfway. I don't know what this army is doing, so we might need to turn around real quick. Maybe we'll go back. We're probably going to lose Xiangyang at this rate. And we have to basically rally around here. Alright. I'm going to leave that alone. We're going to go for the livestock farm. Okay, so I know I can cover this distance next turn. I'm going to rest here and get some replenishment. I don't think we need healing. We can march. Go a little faster. We can pop over here next turn. All right, Wang Long's armies disappeared. Go for the small town first. We can march. There's no garrison at the small town. All right, that's everyone. Now we could try to muster up a new defensive force around the Xiangyang, but I don't know if that's going to work. I just want more authority, actually. Oh, schemey. Okay. We have 9,000 cash. We could just summon a force. It wouldn't muster very well, but with some generals, we can repel this group. Because we just have to beat Handong, basically. Uh, who's going to be good for this? I mean, she has a unique ability. Hmm. Who has better abilities? Baby Wu or Sun Quan? Wait, Chen Pu is also in court. Why can't we recruit him? Oh. That's really good. Can we give you more? Yeah, yeah, she can actually use it in combat. Extra health. Uh, it's okay. Never mind. I'll just give her this for now. Oh, Trempo is here. Tremble doesn't have anything useful yet, but we want to make him useful. Uh, she's higher level right now. Alright, we're definitely keeping one of the Sea Down Cavalries for future use, but everything else can go. We'll pop inside. Who's the administrator here? Oh, Santa doesn't have administrator. Okay, that's fine. I I think we can hold. We have enough abilities here. Armor piercing range damage, three shots. 
Okay. We're just gonna hope that holds. And we used uh, all the movements. Let's just use our money on building. I want to slowly improve the economy. But this needs to go up. Hmm. We can build a four to level three. Yeah, eventually I think we get rid of this. Go for conscription building. Um, farm up. I oh, have six gold left. You can balance things out a little bit. All right, nothing's really changed here. Okay, let's continue. All right, Coral's taking our farmland. Can't do anything about that. Let's let him take it. Jotai just have to take it back. Oh, they leveled up. How lovely. All right, Domain commands their vassal joint war not against us. We lost the farmland. Drugo Down's coming out. Oh, great. All right, we got a few new items. Uh, no gold item, but two silver is nice. So we have this fight we can take. He is in a ship, so he's probably coming over to attack Loyal. He does not have any siege weapons, so he needs at least a turn there. So no rush here. Uh, I can't let him have the territory, so I'm going to go here and attack him next turn. They put us under siege, but they didn't take us immediately. I mean, mainly because they don't have a siege weapon, so we're just going to let them siege us. We're going to start marching. Alright, they just got to hang on a little bit longer. So even though this target's pretty easy, we're going to use this as our save point. Um, let's see, what else we need to do here? Sima Fang, Administrator, give us a bit more food. Alright, it's a free take. He didn't even make it back. Oh man. So sad for him. I'll right, pop this up. Uh, actually, I wanted to draw use army first. Ooh. A bit surprised about that, but okay, that's fine. Um, might change our mind to go for this now because I don't want them to double team them. Alright, I don't see any enemies, but you never know. Alright, they can just rest up right here. So I guess it comes down to Li Bu's fight. We technically want tier 5 private workshop. We also want tier 4 marketplace. Tier 5 in. Oh, we want a lot of stuff. But I guess we go for this first. We continue this. Get this tier 5 state workshop. Income from all sources 15. And then we can also get this minus 8% corruption. This is key. This is going to boost our income by a lot. Alright, guess we end with this fight here. Yangzhou has a military infrastructure. So there is tribuches on the wall and tribuches in the army. The best move for us is actually to move here. We could just turn this army on march. Get them back into the river, and they'll be safe. Right. 
and then we can even land on this side. No, we can't, but like, we can go all the way here and go for an easier target and not worry about them. And this way we can logically take this and save this fight for next episode, I guess. Or if we can trap them to come out. Uh, I don't want to take casualties, so see you guys at the end here. Just a real quick battle tilt, uh, you know, skip through it. Alrighty. Clean fight. Alright, so now we can turn the army. We'll do the level up at the beginning of the next episode. Turn the army down here. We will clean up both of these and probably sweep back toward the city. They will just continue towards Guangling instead and sweep up the coast for easy targets. And Zhou Tai is still going to be busy holding these two fronts, buying time until help arrives. Um, Sun Ce will take this fight. Um, I think we have full movement. Yeah, we do. So we'll just go grab this at next beginning of next episode as well. And come back, I guess, afterwards. We still have to defend this area. We can't go directly into Dong. Uh, but eventually we'll be able to sweep through the central plains, get rid of the Obey and Kongro and Zhuro, and then all our armies can focus up north. Our southern army is still sweeping across uh, what's left of Wang Long's territories, and then we'll go into Zhu Fu's territory and the Han Empire as well. As, you know, the whole map is at war with us, except for Ma Teng, but he's not strong, so like, that's really, he has three counties. Not a big deal. Uh, we'll leave him alone. And Han, Han Sui only has these up here as well, I think. He has like these two, plus potentially all three of these. Uh, Zhejiang actually has, Zhejiang has actually quite a bit. Strangely, this, you know, Shuofang's hers, but don't know why. They should trade these. It will look better. Um, but we're basically have a little issue here, but hopefully our generals can hold and, uh, and we'll see what happens with our army here. I actually kind of want Matong to declare war on us so we can actually start expanding into the silk. Like we can potentially sweep across like this, turn defense into offense, but we can also avoid that situation entirely as well because our win condition is just to clean up all of this, capture the Emperor Sea, and we should be there. Um, right now we have... 48. Not a lot of counties, but there's still tons for the taking down here and also all of this all the way into that. We're probably also going to make a push to clean out the entire north. So we'll hit 95. Don't worry about that. So see you guys next time. Bye!